Okay. Um, I'm going to jack up the sound a bit. Hopefully you'll hear some of what uh, is new. I did a little bit of building. So, just to go over what I did. I really hope you can hear that. Anyway, uh, this is just a water sign, water sign, all the way up. I didn't bother with glass the whole way. So that just goes up to the top. Uh, oh, <laughs> I fell into the water. All right, so let me come up over on this side, and this is my makeshift stairway. Just so I can show you. Listen to the ladder sounds if you can hear them. Pretty good, huh? Hopefully you heard it. All right, so I'm going to seal this up. But before I do, I wanted to show you what I got going on here. When I got to the top, I put another water on top just to kind of push them along. So they get here. And you see that? I didn't, I didn't have to do anything. So I've got a stair block right here and a sign to prevent the water from going any further. But basically, I've got water that flows up to the stair. Watch, I'm just going to stand still. I'm not moving at all. Hand is off the keyboard. And it just pushes me up and over. And the next water brings me up here. And I'm going to place water here. And it'll do the same thing. The water will stop by the sign. It's only too high here so that I can't jump. That's so that they're not jumping before they fall to their deaths. Because that's really the key is if they jump, they'll fall and die. If they don't jump, they'll fall, and they should have a half a heart left. Okay, so I need water, and then I need to get out. Water. Don't die. Okay. So, glass. And I'm going to need that too. Glass, 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 slab, slab, slab. Okay, and I've left the slab off here just so it's easier to get up on top in case I need to. Um, yeah, okay. I was going to place a torch. I'm not really worried about it, so I'm going to leave it there. So at this point, we're good. We can climb back down, go down. So we've got that sealed up. That's there. We're ready to test. I like testing. Boom, that goes off. Boom, that goes off. I heard a spider. That could be annoying. Boom, I'll take that. Boom. Boom. The lights are off in there. And I already see a skeleton on his way. Where's that spider? He's probably somewhere he doesn't belong. So I should be able to see them going up. I think I just missed one. All right, so let's. Uh, that's where the killing spot is. So let's just see if there's anybody that's uh, going up yet. Oh, I think I saw somebody jump down or fall down. I hear bones at the very least. Oh, they're dying. 
Oh no. Let's see if that makes a difference. Aha! <laughs> Alright, so my half slab has saved the day. Hmm. Oh, he didn't make it. All right, so this is still problematic. Uh, if I take that one out and put that there. Oh, they're still, they're still dying. See if that makes a difference. They sure are loud. I don't need to use that up. He lived. Okay, so that's that's fine. They're coming in. Um, if I put my stair there and a block, that should be fine. Well, I'm getting my arrows, and really, that's what the name of the game was here. Okay, this seems to be working. <laughs> it's making me laugh. <sighs> so, here goes one. See, hello. Up you go. <laughs> Oh, I'm so giddy right now. All right. And the sun is going down. So what this means is I do not need to use any of my weapons or anything. I can just punch and that'll be fine. But I did uh, put one more uh, bookshelf in. So I can get a 21. Knockback, sharpness 3, and fall. <laughs> yeah, that, that's good. I'm happy with that. Um, you see that I got some slimes. Um, I happened to go back down into the ravine, and I guess they, sli they spawn right there, so that's all working out good. Uh, Zombie meat was kept with the food, oddly. So now I've got lots of slime. That means I can make lots of blaze powder. So I can have health potions for days. Yeah, I'm going to run out of bones. Or run out of uses for bones, I think. I better put those back in there. No, I don't need those anymore. So let's put them my wooden things back. Okay, so at this point I've got 30 arrows. Bucket goes up. Uh, I'll put the glass over here. Okay, let's go punch a few things. And then I'm gonna call this video because it's not my normal time for doing this sort of thing. So I just come down here. Oh, he dropped a bow. Interesting. That right there. It's a nearly busted bow, but that's all right. And I get the 38 arrows. All right, so there we go. Now my skeleton spawner drop trap is complete. Thank you, YouTube.
Oh, it sounds like cutting through cloth or something. So this is how it works. They come up, they go across. I should be able to watch, but that would be very boring. And then they drop down and they don't do so well. And I'm not entirely certain where I need to be for optimum idling if I wanted to do so. But as you can see, there's nobody in there right now. Oh, somebody just fell. Is it too bright, maybe? I wonder. Hmm. That's okay. No, they're still spawning, so we're okay. All right, let's just come out. So that's the spawner. And that's this video. Let's come up here again. Ta-da, my angry looking obelisk. But it doesn't have to be pretty, it works. Wonder if I, I don't want to mess with it. Okay, so with that in mind, I'll now be able to uh, get the stuff that I need, meaning the arrows, and uh, level up if I need to, although I don't really think I need to do any of that. So I guess I could add that as an achievement on my wall. So achievements. Uh, six. Uh, what am I saying? Uh, arrow supply. Beautiful. All right. Um, so that's it for this video today. Uh, this is just a little bonus video. I will probably still do a regular one as well. Um, yeah, so I should be able to see them through the window. It'll be fun in the texture pack when I can actually have clear glass. Whatever, I'm rambling. See you guys uh, next time.